everybody so today I'm gonna have a squad builder for Prince Liga I would call this a quite an expensive squad and this is for iOS by the way so let's begin in goal we have Leno Leno has a diving of 82 handling 82 reflexes 83 and positioning 83 although those stats may not be very good but based on my experience with him he's as good as Casillas I would say so next up for the left back we have Inform Rodriguez he has a pace of 77 which makes him one of the best left backs and given that his defending is 82 he's also not bad similarly his inform is only 25,000 coins which is quite good which is quite affordable too at the same time next up at the left side of in the back in the right side of the back four we have um, our right back from Bottleman Pierce Cat um, I got him for 10,000 which is also quite affordable and he has a uh, pace 81 which is quite easy uh, for a defender at 80 which is quite enough to defend against the uh, fast paced teams next up we have our center backs first of all is Hamos uh, Hamos has a rating of 86 and is one of the highest but given that he's 86 and still is 30k if you save enough, he will be good enough for you. Uh, one thing I don't like about his pace is 66 pace. But his defending is one of the best in the world. Which is 88. I mean the best in the game. Next up next to him we have someone from Dortmund which is... Sorry from Bayern which is Benicia. Benicia is quite cheap. 6500 and his pace is 75 adding on to that we have his defending which is 88 which is acceptable and is quite good for a world class team next up at the left mid we have Marco Roos Marco Roos is definitely recognized by many players since FIFA 14 and his pace of 91 Sim at the same time his shooting of 86 passing 84 which is very good for a 1-2 game or a fast attack through the wings. As a midfield, we have the best midfielder for Bunsa Liga over here, which is Suchneiser. As you can look, although his pace is not very good, but his shooting and passing makes up for it. Next up, uh, we have Alarm. He's a central mid because I use a modifier on him from center defending to center mid. His passing and his pace is very good, but his back, the things that pulls him down is shooting, but he's extremely good given that he's the second best midfielder in Bundesliga in the game. On our right wing, we have uh, Muller. The reason why I choose Muller is because, first of all, he's extremely affordable, and I'm not able to purchase his teammate which is a very expensive guy and his pace of 81 and 84 and shooting 84 may not be so comparable to Hamos oh sorry Rus because of the pace but he has played very well for me as you can see he played one game and managed to score a goal in that game I haven't got him for quite long though next up on strikers we have a overpowered striker he's called Ramos although his stats is 79 but his pace is 86 which is like 19 game you feel, you feel like it's 19 game his shooting also feels like 19 game you can see that he has 79 goals in 103 games Mainly reason because this is a 4-2 formations which are two strikers and I tend to play through the wings so therefore he's only scoring 79 out of 103 games 
but that's about 80% of the games he scored. And lastly, the other side of the front two, we have Olik. He's uh, extremely cheap. He's a very good for a basic squad, a star squad. And once you pair these two up, he's peace. Because look at space is 80, which is good enough. And his shooting is very similar to Ramos in game 2, although the stats look bad. And I'm preparing to purchase a uh, Bayon Striker after I save up for it. So, thank you for watching. Please give a like and comment below if you would like to see more videos like this or any tutorial videos I will try my best to help you find a method or produce a video for this meant for that so thank you for watching and thanks for your time